That's since you get your ring on, sir. Well, the fact is, it means it means for the whole cause. The cause is what we're after here. I mean, you you, you know, guys like yourself and all youngsters behind us have to understand that this didn't the door didn't just open and you walked in. There was a lot of people who made sacrifices and a lot of people who did a lot of things to get the game where you could even play it. Mm -hmm. So that's what it means to me. It means to me that we were successful at what we did. You know, I never had a chance to go to a white school. I never had a chance mm -hmm. to hit a, a white player until I came into the pros. I, don't, I find that to be, in, in America, the home of the land of the free and the home of the braves. Mm. Okay? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's, that's what we're trying to rule out. And we want our youngsters to understand that this started long before they were born and they got to carry the banner on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Now, tell me the story you told last year. What, uh, what I was one of your repeat all of what I said? Not everything, year. but what was one of your favorite parts about actually making the NFL? That you actually got to play against the Caucasian players, you got to take out some aggression that was going on in that time. Well, I never had the opportunity to play in high school or college on no level against a white player until I came into the pros. Yeah, I was mad as hell at that. And that helped me take the next step, which was to be the best in the NFL, which I did. And that's that's the motivating factor. And you know, you gotta have something to motivate you in life. Like, it don't just happen. You have to be motivated. And that's what did, did it for me. Well, one last thing, I don't want to hold you, but those Rams teams you played on with Merlin Olsen and the Fearsome Force, those are some legendary teams. I watched a lot of the NFL films. And, uh, talk about playing on those teams with those Rams in that era, man. Well, you know, you, you played with guys that you didn't know whether they liked you or not. You played at a time where you, you know, you, you did your job and you tried to do your job the best of your ability. Because if you didn't, they'd run you out of there with the drop of a hat. So that you had to hang on, you had to stay there. Because the people behind you that were coming up was the very most important thing. If I go, you'll never, you wouldn't, right. uh, guys like me, if they'd have gone, you wouldn't see another black ball player. It's just like, it's just like if, I'd have, if I'd have finished James Harris off, you wouldn't have seen no more black quarterbacks for another 50 years. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No, you don't. You try to look that up. You wouldn't have seen another black quarterback for another 50 years, okay? One last thing. In Super Bowl, Mike Tomlin is the head coach. Talk about from your angle seeing a black man winning a Super Bowl and then coming back to you later and coaching in a Super Bowl. Well, to see a black guy get a job in the NFL as a coach. I mean, that didn't happen. That, you know, that happened. And to see a black president, you understand, that happened. I never thought that would happen. I would have bet against that. To see a, Also, to see a black center, to see a black offensive guard, to see a black middle linebacker, to see a black tight end. Those positions we could not even play. Couldn't even line up in those positions. Okay? Yes, sir. So it all means something. It all means a great deal to see the whole thing evolve. And everybody now, judge me on my abilities and the contents of my character. And we all can get it done. Yes, sir. And, you, and that is what you young people got to understand. Because you got to carry the banner on. Yes, sir. You understand? You got to do it. You got to get the rest of it out. I'm done. Yes, sir. I can't do no more. So now you got to carry the banner on. And you can't back up, you can't bend, break, nor splinter, and you can't allow nobody to change your direction.